Listen up moms, if you've got little ones at home but you still have this dream to be in real estate, I want you to know you can do both. Now I know you're looking at selling Sunset and those girls on there don't have kids. They're not running carpool. They're not going to every field trip and everything in between. They're dressed to the nines, wearing stilettos every day and probably hitting the gym every single day as well. And you're like, that's just not the station of life that I'm in. And let me tell you, if you wait until you are in the station where your kids have grown, then you have missed out on some prime business building years, my friend. Because I'm here to make a statement that moms with little kids are in the best position to be realtors and to start your real estate business. Here's why. You are surrounded by other women, more than likely, who have kids that are the same age of yours, and they're in the same stages of life. So you're gonna start with the first time home buyers, right? And then you have more kids, and then you go to school with them together, and then your kids play on the same sports teams. You might go to the same gym, same church, same restaurant, same play groups, right? You're making relationships all day long. And do you know what the number one thing that people who are successful in real estate, you know what they have in common? They have the most relationships. Here's what I want you to do. Chances are you have another bestie. Maybe she also has the same dream to be in real estate as you. Partner together. This is exactly what my sister and I did. So while the babies were napping, one of us was at home with them, the other was out showing. While one of us was at a closing, the other one was at home with the kids. While one of us was at an inspection, the other one was there and we switched off. We teamed up. So when we went on appointments together, we also sold ourselves as two for the price of one twice the availability, and you're tapping into two times the database, two times the network of people. Partner up. You don't start seeing repeat business until you've been about five to six years in the business. Then you're going to start getting a lot of calls back from people who want to sell the house you sold them and buy something new. This is when you have made it. Then you don't have to be prospecting as much, but you're going to have the business come in because it's referrals, because all those years while the little ones were at home, while they're sleeping and napping, you can be making videos, doing social media, planning client events, doing it all around your kids' schedules while still being an active mom in their lives. Now, I know I'm jumping all around in this video, but I get really passionate about it because I just got done talking to a mom who wants to leave her current career to do this, and she thinks that she can't do it right now, but you can, you can, and I'm here to help you. My entire tribe is made up of other realtor moms just like me who show you how to be successful in real estate. My name is Kim Dean. I lead the Simply Texas Real Estate Group at eXp and follow for more info.